Well, hey there guys, uh, welcome back to Original Minifig. My name is Kevin and welcome back to the Empire State Building. It's been quite a while since I've done an update on the building. Um, the progress uh, has been going forward. It's just that the building is so large that if you uh, want to do updates that really amounts to anything, then you need to space it out a little bit more than every month. I used to have a monthly update, but it's uh, it's like a, a thousand bricks is, is like a drop in the ocean on this thing. So um, I, I would like to space out the updates a little bit longer or a little bit more in between so that you can actually see a difference. But now there is a difference in the building. There should be quite a few differences. So I'm gonna take you on a little tour of the updated Empire State building. So let's get right to it. Um, this side of the building, which is the 5th Avenue side of the building, um, is uh, uh, come along quite a bit. Uh, you can see, see all of this stuff is new now. Um, I've pulled the sections apart a little bit here because uh, as you probably know, <clears throat> this thing is going to be so big that you're going to need, um, you're going to need uh, uh, to be able to pull it apart. Uh, so it is in sections. Uh, so I pulled it apart a little bit here, but you can see the roof is continuing on here. It's going to have the same uh, same uh, tiles as, as this right here. Uh, and then it continues right over here. So this is the support for this section right here. Uh, you can see I, I've used a little bit of Duplo as I'm building up the interior uh, offices on this section. Um, so this one has come along quite a bit. You can also see the detailing now with the gray, the light gray, and the the dark gray on the uh, around the window frames. Here's uh, our friend a Mardi Gras man who's balancing up here on the on the on the girders. You know he's a daredevil. So there's a couple of skydivers up here, and there's also Old Man Superman. Uh, that was Eight Ball Man's uh, mascot at some point. And just to show you some more people, here's, uh, here's actually um, Bracer Chris. He has taken over the, um, uh, the job as a foreman on this project so that it'll move forward um, because it was, uh, seems to be stuck a little bit for a little while. So uh, we had to have some, some help. And now that Bricer Chris has taken over as the foreman, he has really get this project going again. So, um, this part here is uh, is new. Uh, all of this is all new, uh, and I've also almost completed this section right here, with the exception of the interior. Um, see, I, I slid it over. Now you can kind of see how the how the sections are. This is a modular building, um, uh, because you know the the levels are not split between the the floors. It's split split between every five floors instead. So you can stack five and five floors because this thing will be 30 feet tall when it's done or just about there's even going to be a subway runner running underneath it so uh, i'm hoping you stick with this channel to uh um to see the progress of this building it's going to be one of the largest lego creations ever built just so you know that Let's step into the building for a second here because uh, this building is all about support. You need lots and lots and lots of support. And you can see that I have completed all of the support on the interior uh, wall on this side. Uh, so a lot of two by fours, lots and lots of two by fours. Uh, and then this section right here, they're all two by threes. Lots and lots and lots of two by threes. Um, I'm trying to, uh, I'll try and get a hold of the ones that are most affordable. You can see oranges and lime greens and reds are pretty affordable uh, compared to many others. And then even on this side, I've started to build up the support. This, all of this is brand new guys. It's. Uh, you have not seen any of this before. Uh, and again, this uh, section right here is uh, it's going to connect over here and then we continue all the way this, this way right here. 
and coming this way if I can move some of this out of the way because it's kind of a mess in here um, you can even tell that I've started building the support up on this side this wall right here is brand new I've also completed this wall right here and here's the back side of the mural in the grand lobby if you haven't seen the grand lobby I made a video just the other day that shows you um, what the grand lobby looks like on the inside it's pretty cool you should check it out I'll put a card in the video for that video and from this angle right here you can kind of see the <laughs> the full interior view of this side uh, all of this stuff in the center is going to be built up with a wood structure so that I can stick the next uh, the next big uh, section on top of there this is the Lego Empire State Building Project. As you can see right here in the front. So let's get a couple of cool shots. I've always kind of like this side right here. Try and get further away so you can get more of the building in shot. It's pretty cool how this thing has come along. I've been uh, spending the last uh, two years on this thing. So I don't know how many bricks I have, but uh, it's, uh, it's quite a few. So that's it for this update of the Empire State Building. Again, please subscribe to my channel if you uh, do like this project. I have lots of other projects going on too. Um, so I hope you stick around and if you like this video, go ahead and press the, press the like button. I always appreciate that. So thank you for watching. I'll see you back here next time. Play well.